Uzohu, are you hearing that Tuba Global Foundation leadership has a lot of hidden agenda and secret activities that make their operations very suspicious? From the onset of the emergence of the app in Tuba Global Foundation, when Ambassador Teofilos requested that all NGOs should upload their data into the app before disbursement can take place. I challenged the management to publish the names of the approved 120 NGOs who complied with their, with their directives and disbursed to them immediately. They couldn't do so till date. The reason is because Tobas Global Foundation has beaten more than they can show. They deliberately collected 500,000 each from far more than 120 angels and thereby messed up the sanctity of disbursement. Adam saw that he was neck and hide himself. Ambassador Theophilus Airboy collected 500,000 each from up to 800 angels instead of the 120 angels as approved by the government for disbursement before the end of this year, 2022. If the foundation is truthful, let them publish the names of the NGOs who paid the required 500,000 Naira disbursement clearance fee, let the whole world see. They could not because Adam is now neck and went into hiding. Theobat's Global Foundation Management and the CEO Ambassador Theophilus Eboy have eaten the forbidden fruit and went into hiding. They have given room for the enemy to bite them because they have broken the hedge by dealing in dishonesty. Quite unfortunate that the teeming majority of men of God in Grant community are Judas Iscariot. They betray and sell their congregation for material things and money so sad. Alright, my viewers are too. What's your reaction to this? Please uh, do it to drop your reaction in the comment section. Your voice will be and clear around the world. And ensure you subscribe to our channel. Uh, this is uh, from uh, Andrew Shebiri, a popular Tibet Grand subscriber. You know, send this strong message to Comrade Uzohu, who happens to be a prominent Tubat Grand subscriber. Okay? Alright, uh, what's your reaction to this? Please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section. Your voice be heard and clear around the world. And then show you subscribe to our channel uh, for more updates from the Let's Press. Uh, thanks and God bless as you subscribe to our channel. As you subscribe to our channel, do not you know forget to spread this report, share this report, share this report across all supreme liberation, same typical golden bridge, name it. Uh, share the report across all news platforms. Thanks and God bless. And uh, let's see. Okay having some network issues but let's see all right we have a ration here this is from um, Shidilim Aronu yes Shidilim Aronu let's see what Shidilim Aronu is saying it says uh, Apostle Tio Eboy is not hiding he is preaching in his church now see Apostle Tio Philos Eboy is not hiding he is preaching in his church now, okay? 
and uh, Andrew Oshebiri here the reply to Shide Lim Arono is saying uh, not hiding in that sense it's just an adjective showing their lifestyle of secrecy and not a non transparency in their dealings okay then uh, Shidilim Arunu says uh, okay he replied to Andrew Oshibiri then uh, Shidilim Arunu again says uh, are you saying that there is no money to disburse hmm. Andrew Oshibiri here says uh, not at all I'm neither for nor against I'm simply sending them out to disburse immediately if they have the grants that's all I do okay then uh, O'Rock Jerry yes O'Rock Jerry says uh, she didn't know let him publish the listing the NGOs that pay the favorite thousand. Well. Okay, so let him publish the list of the NGOs that paid the 500,000 naira, as according to Orok Jerry. Uh, we're still here taking more rations, uh, stay tuned, please. Andrew Shebiri to Shidilim Arunu says, uh, Not really, Tuba Blue Foundation leadership should show transparency in dealing with her grand subscribers they shouldn't act like they are not thieves but when the passes by something gets missing from very funny all right we're still here taking more rations uh, uh stay tuned please okay uh this is from a uh, uh, solomon bem lutia he says uh, you have said it all. There is darkness in the Grant Colony. Okay? I say you have said it all. There is darkness in the Grant Colony, that according to Solomon Ben Lotia. Fawaz Kata says uh, it's a shame, meaning the delay tactics and dribbling will continue. Okay? Then uh, Nelly Banks says that uh, you have said it all. You have said it all. Okay. And uh, this all we can take for now. Thanks and God bless. Ensure you subscribe to our channel. Uh, spread the report. And uh, bye for now. Do well to subscribe to our channel and spread the report. Share it. Okay. Share this video please.